Hello everyone, so here is a quick tutorial to show you how to create a uh, media carousel, how to modify it so that we have labels under each element. So whether it's a video like this one here, or whether it's just normal image, we can have a caption. So to accomplish this, the first thing you'll want to do is to go on your page and to add the uh, media carousel element. After this, uh, and this design will work with the carousel and the cover flow. I will show you a bit later. Uh, after this, you simply add your image or videos and you add a caption. Here I added the same thing everywhere, but really what you want is caption. Uh, after you've got the caption set up for all your items, you can set the other settings as you wish. And then you would go here and under overlay, you choose text. And for the caption, you choose caption. And then the only thing that we need now is the code to uh, make it so that uh, instead of being an overlay, it's actually a caption. Of course, now there won't be an overlay anymore, but that's kind of what we want. We want the text to be under and always visible. So uh, the only other step needed is to copy paste the code. You will be able to get it from the link provided in the description. And then under, if you have Elementor Pro, you can simply paste it under Advanced. And if you have uh, Elementor Free, let me quickly show you. So you would add a HTML element pretty much anywhere on the page. You write the uh, style tags and you copy paste it in between the style tags. And when we have the CSS on the page, then uh, it's ready to go and it's working just as intended. If you have uh, many such element uh, on your uh, page and you want it to be only one element, then you can add uh, a class name. Let's just say like a caption uh, carousel. And then in the code, you would add this uh, right after the element or section part. So space, uh, caption carousel, and the same for all three of them. So after section, and then here. And uh, let's see, why is it not working? Caption carousel, caption carousel. Let's expand this a little bit just to confirm that the spacing is fine. Oh, here. And here. All right, and now it's working. So that's how you would make it uh, to have, to be only on, on one such uh, uh, slider. And now let's say was to have another one on the same page that does not have this class. Then it's back to default behavior for uh, this one. And let's go back to this one and let me show you uh, what it happens when we have cover flow. So with cover flow, it looks like this. Uh, so it works pretty much as well as we, we can expect with the exception. All right, so I hope you uh, enjoyed and uh, please subscribe for more content like this. Thank you.